All right, what's going on YouTube? Penguin Zombie here, back with another YouTube video. Super excited about this one. We're looking at Legendary Hiding Spots, Episode 9. If you didn't know the series has no stupid intros or anything to waste your time, we're jumping right into it. So for this first spot in Lazy Lagoon, uh, all you want to do is edit that ramp right there, and you can get inside this chest spawn attic area. Um, you can catch anyone off guard here. Great spot for an ambush. Um, but yeah, just a pretty good spot. Now this next spot is in the middle of Tilted Towers. This is the new building. Uh, what you want to do is jump on top of this pallet jack from the back. If you jump on the, uh, if you try to jump on top of the pallet jack from the front, uh, it'll just bump you off. But anyway, you just want to jump place your floor so you can destroy it through the pyramid, and then just make an inverted pyramid and uh, chill in the corner. Uh, just an amazing spot. And if anyone is going to see you, they have to be like right directly beneath you. So definitely a great spot to chill out, drink a chug jug, use the bathroom, join a party, etc., etc. Play hide and seek. You already know what the deal is, um, but yeah, moving on. This next spot is in Shifty Shafts. Uh, just an amazing spot. Um, no one's going to see it coming. Super simple to do. All you want to do is build across right here, and um, then just squeeze in the corner right there, and uh, boom, you're in. Super simple. Um, obviously, the spot is going to be better if people are coming down the stairs rather than going up it. Uh, but you can still catch anyone off guard either way. Just land a quick headshot and, and take them out. So pretty good spot to keep in mind. Now this next spot is going to be in Lazy Lagoon again. Uh, this is how you can get behind the the wooden uh, fences, I guess, right there. This is the only way I know how to get back here. Uh, I've tried everything. But um, anyway, you're going to need a chiller for this. All you want to do is put down your chiller trap and then uh, slide across and use sliding. This is the only way I figured out how to get behind this thing. I've tried so many different things, but uh, the chiller is the only thing that I, that I found that worked. Um, but yeah, you just slide across and then you can destroy your structure from behind the fence and uh, leave no trace. Obviously you want to avoid hitting the fence. But yeah, all you want to do is get that chest in the back and then destroy the chest and boom, you're in the greatest hiding spot of all time. Oh yeah. <laughs> yeah, anyway, moving on. So this next spot is going to be near Salty Springs. I believe, I think I heard a few streamers call, like King Richard call this Grandma's House. Uh, not sure what to call this place, but anyway, it's two houses on the outskirts of Salty Springs. All you want to do is get up on this little mini roof somehow and then destroy this ammo box and uh, squeeze back in behind these boxes. Uh, you can build a wall behind you and edit it to be like a half wall, um, just for added protection. Uh, no one's going to really see this coming. Um, you can't see your head if you're coming up the stairs, if you're behind the boxes, you know. So it's a pretty good spot. But this is right across from that house, so we're still in this Salty Springs area. Um, this spot is right next to a chest spawn. All you want to do is jump place your floor, and you have eyes on a chest spawn. Uh, real easy to get an ambush kill right here. Um, you could easily nail a few headshots really quickly, get their loot and the chest loot, so win-win. Now this next spot is underneath the new building in Tilted Towers. Uh, just a secret spot. There's four teddy bears in here with a sleeping bag. Not sure what's going on here. Um, pretty interesting, if I do say so myself. Alright, this spot is inside this pawn shop inside Tilted Towers. Super simple to get into. All you want to do is jump on top of these boxes and then destroy the security camera. Uh, once you do that, you can crouch down and and uh, go right into the double chest spawn area without destroying the boxes. So, super cool method to know about. But I just want to take this time to say that I'm proud to say that we have never duplicated a single spot in this series, guys. Uh, old sub subscribers might notice some duplicate spots from other series, but we have never done uh, the same spot twice in this legendary hiding spot series. So, just want to say thank you to, to everyone watching and for commenting and liking the videos. It uh, means a lot. And we got more of this coming soon. You know, every time they update the map, we'll always put out some new hiding spot videos. So, thanks, you guys. But anyway, this next spot is in the pirate ship in Lazy Lagoon. Uh, you can head glitch, I guess you'd call it, uh, in the in the bow, I guess is the front of the, the ship. I don't know what the front of the ship is called. Pretty sure it's the bow, but could be wrong. Anyway, uh, once you're up here, you can destroy pretty much anything. Um, I, I expect them to patch it, but it works for now. So, pretty cool thing to know about. Now, this next spot is in Tilted Towers in the new building, right in the middle. Uh, you can get or in between these two stairs if you just drop all the way down, or you can go through the front, through this wall I'm destroying right here, and uh, just an interesting spot, you know, nothing too crazy, but just a good spot to know about. Now this next spot is amazing, this is in Shifty Shafts, 
Uh, all you want to do is squeeze right behind the staircase right here. Super easy. You just walk right in. You don't need to build anything or, you know, get any traps or anything. Uh, just a great spot to know about. You're going to catch anyone off guard here. I guarantee it. Now, this next spot is in the new Tilted Towers building again, right in the middle. Uh, there's a chest spawn in this inaccessible area. You can get to it however you want. Um, the whole point of this, is, though, is to go through the ceiling right here and drop down into the bathroom stall. You can get into any of the bathroom stalls in this game, but since this, this is the new building of Tilted, I thought I'd just throw it in here. Now, moving on, this next spot is on the very outskirts of the map. Uh, this log cabin, it's got two chest spawns. It's near the the uh, new Sunny Seps location. And anyway, um, what you want to do is whack out this back triangular wall right here, and... Uh, and you're already in it. So, pretty good spot. It's an honorable mention. Thought I'd throw it in here, but uh, you just hide behind the boxes and you can ambush anyone coming up. Uh, you don't have to build behind you because it is, because your back is facing the, the edge of the map. So, I don't know. Definitely an honorable mention for sure. But anyway, moving on. This spot is near the stern of the pirate ship, which is just the back of the boat. And you can destroy this wall behind this chest spawn. And uh, massive hollow area here. You know, you can have an entire team. Um, for whatever reason, good spot to, you know, to hide for hide and seek or whatever. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, definitely a great spot if you want to keep that chest going, you know, keep the chest noise, ambush anyone who comes in that room. Great spot for it. Now, moving on, this spot is in retail row. Uh, a lot of things have changed in retail, but, um, this spot hasn't. You can destroy this floor, or this roof piece right here and drop behind the stall and uh, camp on top of the head teddy bear so they can't see your feet. And what makes this spot so good is that there's a chest spawn right in front of you. I love how in all these hiding spots they have chest spawns right in front of you. It's a big coincidence. But anyway, uh, great spot for an ambush. Now, this next spot is in Polar Peak. There are so many hiding spots in this castle. Uh, if you guys want to go check out my Polar Peak hiding spot video, uh, I did make an episode on that. But um, so many hiding spots in this place. Uh, this particular one, all you want to do is use your edited ramp, jump place your floor, and we're not, I guess not jump place, crouch place, if that's a thing, but yeah, great spot for an ambush. Obviously, there's almost no foot traffic over here, so probably better for hide and seek, I don't really know, but this is going to be our, is this our last spot? Yeah, this is our last spot. Uh, this is how to get inside the truck in Tilted Towers near the vending machines. Um, super simple to get in here. I'm sure many of you have done it already, but just thought I'd throw it in here. And that's going to be it for the video, guys. Hope you like what you saw. If you did, drop a like, and I'll see you guys in my next video. <laughs>